Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's Aces High. If y'all are new to my channel, I'm a beginner risk player who's just trying to get better. So if you see something I did wrong, let me know. Seriously, I appreciate the comments. I really do. All right, so uh, today we're playing World Domination on the Classic map. Um, I'm set up decent in Europe, honestly. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Um, oh, I'm also set up to get an early Australia. I normally don't like to go Australia, but honestly, that might be the play here. Take my three troops. Go here. Yeah. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll take this. We'll hit it. We'll hit it. And then we'll end it by transferring up. So now there's a four at the gate. Let's see if red really wants to get in. They could bust through with their two, but I don't think that's going to happen. All right. So that nine is going to go. Is it going to go through Europe? It might. Keep in mind, Fog of War is on. All right, you guys, so uh, let's take a look real quick. Uh, we do have blizzards on. So these two blizzards don't really do much. In fact, they kind of make Asia harder to hold. I mean, not really, I guess. Um, all that they do is they make, like, North America kind of easier to screw over Asia, if I'm honest. Um, anyway... We have this one in the middle of Africa. That one does absolutely nothing. Uh, so blizzards are pretty much useless. As far as fog of war goes, if you guys don't know, basically if I don't have a country, if I don't, if I don't have a country touching that spot, like these two, uh, or most of you know Africa, then I don't get to see it. I have no idea what's going on. Uh, so for instance, um, red put eleven here, probably to attack my five and take Europe. He's giving me a chance to get away, uh, which, okay, what are you doing, Black? Which I don't think I'm going to do. I don't think I'm going to step down. I would love to take Europe. Okay, Black wants, Black wants there. I wouldn't mind taking South America. That feels pretty easy to take, if I'm honest. Yeah. All right, let's put like two more right here. And then we'll put a few troops in there. There we go, get another plus two. Wow. See, that is why you use your slider. I kind of screwed up my whole South America plan, not gonna lie. Damn. I wouldn't mind getting these troops out of here, but that's just not going to happen. Hmm. All right, let's end it. And let's do this. No, you know what? Let's do this. Yeah. All right, so red wants Europe. That's fine. Because I am getting a plus two bonus in Australia right now. And next turn, I think I can get a plus two bonus. Not get it next turn, but like secure South America next turn for another plus two bonus. If you guys are new to uh, to risk, like I said, this is the classic map. Uh, as far as bonuses go, we have two, uh, two places that are uh, plus two bonuses. We have Australia, which is a one point hold for two. And we have South America, which is actually a two point hold for two. Then we have Africa, which is a three point hold. Is he coming in? Is he really going to go six? You want South America that bad? Uh, anyway, Africa is a three-point hold for three. North America, my personal favorite on this map, and I think the best in my opinion, is a three-point hold for five. Europe is also five, but it's a one, two, three, four-point hold. And then we have Asia. It is a five-point hold for seven. As far as people go today, uh, position one, we do have the black uh, player from America, Ione Blue, perhaps. I think that's their name. Uh, let's see. All right, let's stick some right here. And let's get black out of here. Just because black does have a card trade in and they would be before me, uh, which I do not like. 
I'd love to get this, but uh, I don't think it's going to happen this turn. He does have an 18, and he can go through me if he really wants to come down here. I don't think he's going to worry about it. Black is dealing with North America. Uh, all right, back to the game. So in position three, we have the red player from Mexico, Canelo. Canelo. Uh, looks like red is, is definitely taking Europe. Interesting how they're fortifying back to the right. I wonder if they're trying to take Asia at the same time. Uh, if so, I don't think that's the smartest move, if I'm honest. Hmm. Uh, position four, we have the yellow player, also from America, and that is General General de Balzac. That's funny. All right. Uh, we are playing a fixed game, meaning that uh, it's the trade-ins don't get bigger. Three infantry is worth four. Three cavalry is worth six. Three artillery is worth eight, and one of each one is worth ten. That includes two in a wild. What you doing, yellow? You're attacking somewhere. I think yellow's taking Africa right now. No. If you, okay, if, if, if yellow actually did that, that means the yellow lost every other battle. And that is bad news for yellow. I need to put a few more in Australia. I got a trade? I don't. All right, we are going to put one more here and then the rest over here. And let's do that. And attack phase. Let's go ahead and transfer one over. All right, so that does give me a plus four bonus. I'm getting two and two if I can hold it for one more turn. Red is backing up. That's fine. They just now saw the 21. They had no idea black was there. There you go. Oh my God, is North America not being taken? Because it has been several turns. I mean, what round is it? Round four? Yeah. All right, I'm the only one getting a bonus unless yellow is getting one. Did yellow just get one? Six. Yeah, yellow did get a bonus. So they have Africa, um, but they're only getting a three. I am getting a four. Do I have a trade in? I do. It's a 10 man trade in. I'm definitely going to cash that in to secure Australia next turn and then just start beefing up my borders here. And I'll probably take that three if it stays alive through black and I will see if I can grab a card out of it. Or this three straight up. I might I might try to take that. Interesting that black hasn't been expanding very fast. 21 is really tough to deal with. Um, so, I mean, that's a mighty army for sure. Okay, I think I'm going to put five here. Uh, to the entrance of Australia. Normally I would take here, but I don't want to make any enemies right now. Um, so I'm just going to leave it be. Oh, black got a 10 trade in. Is that all going on 21? Oh, God. He might break my South America right here. He's definitely taking uh, North America, that's for sure. Or is he taking Asia? Oh, no. He's being real slow about it. That's fine. So let's trade those in. We're definitely going to put, like, I don't know, four there. I, I knew I said I was going to do five, but nah, man. And I think I'm going to do the other 14 there. That definitely scares me more. There we go. I will take that. And by transferring it down. All right, so we got a 20, a 10, and an 11 guard. I'm feeling pretty good because this is a fixed game. Red just got his card. That's perfectly fine. Once black takes North America, black will be getting more troops per turn than me. But for now, I can keep on stacking up troops, and I'm getting significantly more. I mean, how many did I get? Three troops. Yellow with their Africa got six. And meanwhile, I am getting eight. So I'm getting five extra per turn uh, than North America or than black right now. Black needs to take North America. I know you're not trying to overextend, but you need to take it. Also, what's going on with red? I thought that red wanted 
wanted Europe. Didn't see that coming, did you? I got you, man. Don't worry, we're good. Seven. All right, well, that was definitely less than I thought it would be. Um. Okay, let's attack that. That sucks. All right, let's attack this. 28%. Are you kidding me? I'm just going to leave it there, actually. I'd rather guard Australia from here because I like it when nobody, you know, you ensure that nobody can take Asia. All right, Black is officially getting more troops than me. However, I think Black is like 20 troops back. Um, so, oh, nice. I have a 10 man trade. Oh, my God. Did not see that coming. That's rough. Not going to lie. I think I need to kill black or like knock them out of North America. I know that sounds a little crazy, but I think that's what I have to do. Cause I'm not going to get Australia back. That's fine. But this is 36 troops. He had what? 20. He's going to get like eight right here. So that'll be like 28. Because now I'm getting the smallest bonus on the board without Australia. Interesting. I, I normally don't like to do this, but I think I'm going to stab black in the back. Damn, nine troops. Do not like that. So I'm going to get two plus three. I'm going to get five. Trade in, I get 15. It's going to be 35. Yeah, that's not ideal. He shouldn't have put three here. Let's be real. That was a stupid move. Yeah, that was a very stupid move. Black has a card trade. Damn. I don't know why I did that. Okay, he's matching troops. I can go for that. That's fine. I'll leave it 1818. He doesn't know what's going on behind here. If he breaks that one, he will be able to see my, my white, though. So we'll see. Two, three, four. If he puts troops there, 
he has to fight through two, one, two, three. So he has to leave three behind. He probably loses next one, so four. God, but it could be a 17. He could have freaking 13 left if he wanted when he got down here. Mm-hmm. See what black does i think he trades yes and it's a 10 of course 20 huh <laughs> he just suicided on me Okay, well, yellow is definitely going to take advantage of this. And then black will kill me next turn in Europe. No, yellow will kill me right here. Potentially. Probably. It's a lot of troops. Yellow is going to have like 40 on here. So you gonna chase me in? That's the real question. You can take Europe with that. Come on, man. What are you gonna do? He's not sure. He might just break one. But when he sees another one, he might just go for it. See how, how weak I am. Or he might try to take South America. I could see that as well. Because he's not sure what I'm hiding up there. What you gonna do, Yellow? He's attacking somewhere over here. Black's definitely gonna put troops here and break my North America. Without a doubt. Black's, black and black is the only one that knows what's up right now in North America. Yeah. Yeah, he does not like me. Okay, I think I'm the first one to die. Oh, wow. Did Red really just not attack me? He doesn't know what's in there. He, he, is he trying not to make an enemy? Wow, okay. Honestly, I want to kill Black next turn. I got a trade. I do. I have a 10 trade. Oh, yellow's going to kill black. No, he's not. Okay, black has no way of getting this back. As long as yellow doesn't attack me right now in the next like minute. No, he's fortifying. All right, so I get my bonuses. That is good to see. Is he gonna attack? Okay, plus twelve. Let's trade that in. All right.
Okay, he might, yellow might take South America. Red could also break me, but I don't think he will. Yeah, he might. He saw my plus 12. Okay, so red just killed black. The last one was up here somewhere. That makes sense. I think red hits me next. Puts troops here and then swings across. It might not be the case, but I think... Oh, he fortified. Interesting. Okay, so he's going to rip through me next. That is good to know. Look how strong yellow actually is. You think he's got three splits right here? Hmm. Like, I just, I don't know what to do in this situation. This is the, like, this is the area that I need comments, you know? Oh, man. What are you thinking, yellow? I need you to fortify. I'd love another plus 12. I put it on there, it's thir 31. Hmm. Thirty nine. It's not much. How much did Red just get? Five, really? That's it? You only have Australia? Is he on the run? Red might be on the run right now. Okay, so he broke my plus five. Okay, this is going to show weakness, because next turn, even if yellow doesn't break me next turn, uh, it will show that I don't have plus 12 anymore. I'm getting plus seven or something like that. Or maybe plus six. How many troops do I have? Yeah, I'll be a plus six. Significantly weaker. That's half of what I was getting. What are you up to, yellow? Huh. <laughs> Is yellow about to kill red? Red does get cards next turn, this turn. Okay, that gives me more vision. Yellow is definitely going to win this. I'm going to break the top one. Break it. That's not a smart one to break, but go ahead and break it anyway. He's going to break this one right here. If he's smart, he'll break this one. Because if he breaks this one, then let's be real. Without him even knowing, this spot right here is another block. So if I have troops on my other two edges of you know, North America... Statistically, I am more likely to have troops on this one than I am to have on any of these or either of these middle ones. So if he pushes down from here and breaks this one, unless I have troops on here, here, or here, it's no problem. So that's what I, I would do if I was him, if I was going to attack anybody in North America. I don't want to break Yellow's Asia. It's clear that he's going to win. Um, but I don't want to piss him off. Let's 
keep you at 30, Red. Hit it. Top one. Oh, you're moving out, huh? Okay. I'm going to take it back then. No, he's coming back. Interesting. I think these might be his last two, two spots. Maybe not, but I, I think that might be the case. Yellow's about to kill him, I think. Yeah, there's 34. Let's see if it goes this way. Because here's the thing. Yellow's not worried about this at all. You gonna keep on going? Okay, left five. I don't think that's enough to take out three territories. I mean, it is if you get good rolls, but I would have left six or seven. Oh, he's going to put five there just because he's he knows how much I'm getting per turn. That's smart. Wow, yellow's only getting seven. Okay. Well, that's mighty interesting. Come on, show everybody I'm weak. I need red to attack the Northwest Territories. Oh, interesting. Okay, red's stronger than I thought he was. Yellow is actually losing now. Yellow has no... No completed sets. Interesting. Wonder how many troops yellow has. Hit that red. Damn it. Let's do, let's do eight. We'll leave 40 behind. Huh. All right. Let's see if, okay, so red is probably going to break me. They're probably going to put 10 here. No. They bust in through Europe? What's their plan? Are they still only getting five? Yeah, they got five, so they still only have Australia. This is a weird game. Like, it's a very weird game. People are playing really slow, but they're also not caring about the bonuses as much as people normally do. And that kind of surprises me. Oh, he's trying to finish yellow. Don't trade, don't trade, don't have a trade. Don't have a trade. Don't have a trade. Don't have a trade. Come on, I want your cards. Do not have a trade. He doesn't. Maybe he does. He doesn't. Okay. I think he, I think yellow is just right here in Europe. If that's the case, I'm taking all five of his cards, getting an instant trade. And then a potential trade next turn as well. That is going to be kind of freaking fantastic. 
I also need to break Asia from red. Okay, that's an instant trade. For 10, there we go. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Let's end our attack phase by rolling one more back to here. Okay, this is actually looking decent. Huh, he thinks he can break through there. Didn't see 40 coming, did you? No, you didn't. I think what I do on this next turn is I put all my troops right here and then I take my 40 and I got I, I can't talk I gotta I gotta play let's go ahead and trade in for 10 more again Okay, leave three there. End my turn. Transfer these. Does he have a trade? He does not. Transfer these back to here. I think I cannot believe it. I was about to give up. I, I think I'm going to win this game next turn. Yeah. Good game. All right. Go ahead and attack here, attack here, there, there. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. And then we're gonna finish him off. Well played. All right, that's that. Uh, I guess that just goes to show you never give up never surrender <laughs> wow okay did not think i was gonna win that game i'm not gonna lie first game of the day too let's see what their difficulties were master expert and novice oh that is fantastic okay cool that is actually awesome wow who's i facing at the end that was red okay yellow was second to last though the expert got knocked out really early all right, well, I hope y'all dug it. Till next time, this is Ace's High. Look, I'm a beginner, but, like, that's going to boost me up. I, I've lost, like, freaking eight games in a row. I, all I did was lose. <laughs> anyway, till next time, this is Ace's High. I love y'all, and I'm out.